We want to talk to SEPTA spokesperson Carla Shoal Lee. Carla, are you there? Yes, I am. Hi, Jessica. Hi. Hey, hey, thanks. How are you, Carla? Thanks so much for being with us. How are things going? We saw some SEPTA buses rolling through. Well, you know, it's not too bad. I can't believe that you said two months until Memorial Day. I Is know, that what you just said, a little longer, but <laughs> yes, it's wild to think about, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. I well, know. I, you know, welcome to spring, as you say. Well, crews are out. Um, they've been out since yesterday, salting our walkways, platforms, and our parking lots. Um, they're working really hard handling anything that can affect our service, you know, such as down wires, trees, things like that. We'll probably start to see more of that as the snow, the snow continues, of course, because that's going to cause some impact on our wires, um, you know, on our catenary wires and, of course, the trolley wires as well. Right now we have about 15 bus routes that are suspended and several buses are on detour. Our regional rail lines, they look pretty good. You know, our West Trenton line had some um, delays of up to about 20 minutes because we had a car on the, on the track area, but they're that's been since cleared. Our Market Frankfurt line and our Broad Street line, people, that's really the best bet right now for getting around. Um, just look at our website. We're, for the most up-to-date information, that's where you're going to find um, what's running and what's not running. And we only mm -hmm. stop running when it becomes unreliable or, you know, unsafe, you know, for, for our customers. Hey, Carl, how does this compare to the other three that we had in a short period of time? About the same? Uh, more active? What do you think? This is a little different only because of the fact that um, it's heavier snow. It's wet, you know, and so that creates some challenges. But, you know, the nice part about it, Yuki, is that we have um, some great equipment during the storm like this. We're going to send you guys some really good pictures because mm -hmm. our crews are out there actually taking some interesting, you know, shots of, of um, you know, as they're working and, and doing their thing. We have a, um, a three geese Mars. I don't know if you've ever heard of that, but no. it's a, they're cold air blowers, and they, they help us to clear, they help clear the track area, and you know that third rail on the Norristown High Speed Line, it blows out that snow so that we can keep that uh, Norristown High Speed Line running mm -hmm. consistently, and so right now we have one um, at Palton Yard, Liberty Yard, and Haverford Station, so we have them throughout the system, and then we have our jet blower and our three swing masters, I mean, these are really, I, I'm into equipment, so I think they're very fascinating. <laughs> That is. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. Well, so, you guys, it goes without saying, you're prepared for this sort of thing. You have to be to keep everybody getting to where they need to go. Oh, we have to be. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I mean, we, you know, we have our, our preps, and, of course, we had our news conference, because we like to always give our customers options. You know, people listened, and that's the most important thing. Um, you know, they decided to telecommute today or, mm -hmm. you know, do their conference calls from the kitchen of their home in their bathrobes. I mean, it works. It works mm -hmm. for us, mm -hmm. because that means that we can get out there and do the things that we need to do to get us up and running for uh, tomorrow. And you do a lot when it comes to preps. Do your men and women work on the shift, the shift schedule? We do. We mm -hmm. do. Those prep sessions are really fun. We have um, Mike Liberi, um, you know, runs them. And Scott Sauer, our top guys, you know, Jeff Apple, our general manager, he gets involved in it all. And, you know, all of us sit around and we really just go through everything that needs to be taken care of. Where do we need to um, take additional, uh, put out additional trains, um, you know, on certain lines that we don't run a lot, you know, just pulling things from different, from different lines. And, you know, it works and, and we have fun doing it. And, you know, for me, I've, I've been here at SEPTA, what, almost two years now, and I'm learning so much. So, uh, you know, all I can do is I kind of let, I kind of sit and watch the the big guys kind of put it all together. The big guys and girls, I should say. Yeah. Indeed, indeed. Yeah. Well, we appreciate you because I've, I've you, been Carla. with you a long time back to PTC before yeah. SEPTA even was, was around. <laughs> oh so. my gosh, that's right. And yes, and we're 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 trendsetters in that. So we're glad that we got that up and running. So indeed. yes, thank you guys. Well, thanks so thanks much so for much. the update. We all appreciate it very much, and we uh, will certainly yeah. talk with them soon to keep keep job. you all yeah. updated as well.